Thank you. I stand here as a Latina immigrant who grew up in a community where Jews did not wear their kippah outside because they were scared. And I was told that would never happen here. I stand here as the witness of the devastating terror attack in Argentina sponsored by Iran that killed 85 Jews, including my best friend's father, Isaac Huli. And I was told America would never allow terror in its streets. I stand here as the daughter-in-law of Egyptian Jewish refugees who had to flee Egypt and who believed that there would be no anti-Semitism here. I stand here as a graduate of NYU, as a visiting researcher at Wagner, as a religious leader, as a mother, as a Middle Eastern brown Sephardic Jew, as a proud New Yorker, as a proud American. And I stand here to cry out and to rage. What is this? What is this? What is this? How dare, how dare terror sympathizers, Hamas supporters come to this great city of New York? How dare, how dare students across universities threaten and terrorize Jewish students? How dare academia, the supposed bastion of enlightenment values, academia, the ivory tower, parrot theories of colonialism and ethnic studies and use them to legitimize the terror, the murder, and the capture of Jews? How dare they? How dare they? Shame on all those people who speak in the supposed values of human rights and who call for a ceasefire and who don't have a single word to say for Israeli hostages and the humanity of Israeli civilians. Shame on all those people who cry out and say, believe all women, but whose feminism ends the second that rape victims are Jewish Israelis. Shame on all those people who call Israel a white colonialist state, a settler colonialist state. My people are indigenous to the Middle East. Shame. Shame on all those people who dare vilify the one Jewish state in the world and who are showing their ugly Jew hatred for everybody to see. Shame on all those people who cannot say anti-Semitism, who cannot speak about Jews being victims, who say all life matters when it is our lives that are on the line. Shame, shame on all those people who dare, dare tear down posters of mothers, of grandmothers, of babies. Have they no shame? Have they no shame? Shame on anybody, anybody who thinks they can mention a context, a context for murder and for terror against Jews. There is no context in the world that should ever. <laughs>